Well, here at WKRG, we are trying to help save lives one pint at a time. I spoke with a woman who says she would not be alive if it hadn't been for generous blood donors. Chrissy Hines spends a lot of time these days making masks to give to healthcare workers dealing with the coronavirus. She has a giving spirit and was a regular blood donor up until last year. When I was giving blood, I never imagined that I was going to be the person that needed blood. Hines needed pint after it. pint of blood last year so when she was diagnosed with a rare autoimmune disorder affecting her red blood cells. I woke up and I looked in the mirror and I looked like zombie girl. I had no color whatsoever. And a few hours later, I was sitting in the emergency room waiting for a blood transfusion. Life South provides blood to many hospitals in our region. Angela Williams with Life South says they're running low. Right here, we only have one Oneg. One? One Oneg, yes. So, you know, O-negative is the universal donor. They stayed open during the pandemic, but donations are down. One donation saves up to three lives in our community, um, and we really need you to come out. One added feature about giving blood right now is that each donor is automatically tested for COVID-19, and each person will get that result within five to seven days. Life South is getting close to having an emergency need. It is not hard to do. It doesn't take a long time. And right now, more than ever, we really need people to come out and give blood. Hines hopes that people will respond to the call so that she and others will receive the blood she needs to stay healthy.